Hello, my name is Sean Hepburn Ferrer, and I'm honored to sit here today as the ambassador for Rare Disease Day. I was asked to be in this wonderful position because my mother, Audrey Hepburn, passed away from a rare form of cancer 20 years ago. At the time, it was known as adenocarcinoma. Today, we know it as pseudomyxoma. Uh, and if I am really here, it is thanks to you, Don, for having brought up or thrown my name in the hat. Um, and I'm honored, and I thank you for that. She was an um, extraordinary person, one that we all love deeply. And I've just done a, a video for Eurotis uh, in which I speak of the loneliness we felt as a family when we found out um, what was affecting her, the little we knew about what was affecting her, and uh, the fact that at the time um, the only treatment that was available was a chemotherapy that had been available since the 60s. Uh, this morning after breakfast, to sort of brush up, um, I, look, I looked up pseudomyxoma on the wiki page and what a surprise to see that today it is qualified as a uh, disease with a positive prognosis if treatment is started early on and how extraordinary it is to hear that that after 20 years of being out in space and sort of lost today something can be done we can't cure it but we can certainly um, extend the quality of life and, um, and make a big difference. And that means a lot. And it, uh, I think that technology is the key of what is, is bringing us all together and making organizations like Eurotis and your own, um, one in a million, um, so essential because they unite research, they unite advocacy, but they also unite people. And um, once you feel support, I think 50% of the battle is won. And if you don't feel alone and you feel that... Um, our mother often used to say when she went to these camps in Africa, she says, we can't save all of the children, but we can certainly make everyone feel like someone is doing something. And I think that's the miracle um, of the effort and the dream that you had when you created the organization, and certainly um, of creating this kind of network that makes that loneliness we were just speaking about hopefully a thing of the past.